All right, hey guys, this is Renee Fouché here and just wanted to shoot this quick video to kind of talk to you guys about what exactly is a media communication specialist and why you need one if you currently are running a business. Now, a media communication specialist actually um, can encompass a wide range of uh, titles, right? Um, it's pretty self-explanatory if you think about it, right? Um, it's obviously having to do with media, so whether that's TV, um, print, magazines, radio, those are all forms of media, right? Internet, these are all forms of media. Communications is obviously getting the message out. So you know that if you have a business, the key to continuing to grow your business is to be able to get the message out, right? And obviously, if someone's a specialist, this is something that they specialize in. So for most small business owners, they tend to be kind of like a one-man, one-woman show right? They're kind of doing a little bit of everything. Maybe you opened up a bakery and it's really because you really love to bake. And then you get into business with your bakery and suddenly you have all of these different hats that you have to wear, right? You're wanting to do everything. You have to do the marketing, you have to develop the recipes, you have to find the place where you're going to have the bakery, you're having to do all the accounting and so you're you're wearing a whole lot of different hats right now why do you need a media communication specialist for your business well obviously you need to get the word out about your business and maybe you're doing an okay job of that right now however a media communication specialist can come in and actually do what's called a media analysis they can take a look at exactly what it is that you're currently doing in your business if you're using social Social media, you know, they'll be able to take a look at uh, what's going on with your social media engagement. What is happening um, with the posts that you're putting out? Are you getting enough fans? Are they engaging with you? You know, what's going on with that? If you're doing magazine advertising, they're going to want to be able to take a look at what you're doing there and determine what type of results you're currently getting. If you're doing radio ads, TV ads, you know, a lot of small business owners are just throwing things at the wall and hoping that it sticks, right? Because of the fact that they're trying to save a little bit of money. Well, let me just let you know that even though you think you may be saving some dollars by not hiring someone to come in and do this for you, whether it be uh, in an employee status or maybe someone like myself that comes in on a consulting basis and can kind of help you through what it is that you're doing, you may not only be wasting a lot of that money that you're throwing out on the different advertising that you're doing currently, you may be leaving on the table tens if not thousands of dollars in new business that you could actually be generating if only you knew how. So that's what happens with a media analysis. Someone's going to come in and take a look at what you're currently doing. And then your media strategy uh, plan is actually going to come afterward where they're able to possibly uh, recommend some new things that you could be doing right? Let you know some new trends that may be um, speaking to your target market a little bit more. And then actually develop uh, specific campaigns to be able to achieve your current business goals, right? So if your goal right now is to attract new customers, if your goal right now is to increase your revenue per customer, maybe you're wanting to uh, build more of a loyal following. Maybe you want more people to buy more stuff. Whatever your goal is, a media communication specialist will be able to come in and help you to achieve those goals. So if you have a small business, right, what you need to do now is make a decision. Make a decision that you are ready to invest in your business and have a professional Come and help you where assistance is needed, okay? Remember, guys, if you do not commit to spending money and investing, right, investing in yourself, right, you can't expect that other people are going to want to come and spend money with you. When you hold your fist tight like this, it's not open to receive. 
what's out there for you. So that's it. Renee Fouché, always have something to say. And today my message is get a specialist on your side. Get comfortable with being a little bit uncomfortable and go ahead and get your goals achieved. See you next time. Bye for now.